testicular PRP. So this term you must have heard a lot for all those people who are suffering from azospermia and who have got nil sperm in their testes also. So they must have gone through Google and here and there and they must have searched about it and if not through Google also many times what happens you have got azospermia and there is no sperm in your testes also. Then in these cases also you just start thinking that oh may God give me some process some testicular rejuvenation so that my testis is rejuvenated and I can at least produce some sperms so that my wife can become pregnant with those sperms with my own lineage. So for all these patients who are having it and who have got these kind of reports they should try a process of testicular regeneration, rejuvenation. In that we take your blood either from your blood or from the stem cells and we process all the good growth factors and interleukins and we put it in the testis and so an inflammatory state is produced in the testis. So in 50%, 60% cases many times the testis starts procreating, it starts producing sperms so that we are able to retrieve those sperms again or either be micro TZ or anything and or TISA process only so that we can make embryos from your own sperm and we can have we can achieve a healthy pregnancy with your own sperms your own DNA so that is what matters and that is what is the reason that you are getting the IVF cycle done we care about you